given f of x is equal to cube of absolute x we have to show that f double dash exists and then find it now similar to absolute x f x also changes sign that is it is positive x cube if x is greater than 0 negative x cube if x is less than 0 and 0 if x is equal to 0 here both the left hand limit and right hand limit at 0 is equal to 0 hence we can say that f of x is a continuous function to find whether f of x is differentiable at 0 we find the left hand limit and the right hand limit as this is a left hand limit f of h will be equal to minus h cube giving us the left hand limit as minus h square similarly the right hand limit we get h square so at x equal to 0 both these limits are equal hence f of x is differentiable at 0 now we can differentiate f of x either in each interval or as a together so here we have differentiated f of x using chain rule and applied x raised to n is equal to n multiplied by x raised to n minus 1 where n is equal to 3 so absolute x cube becomes 3 absolute x square and then from chain rule we get derivative of absolute x and we know that derivative of absolute x is equal to x by absolute x f dash x gets simplified to 3 absolute x x if we had differentiated it in different interval we would get 3x square for x greater than 0 and minus 3x square for x less than 0 which is same as this now similar to f of x f dash x is also continuous as both left hand limit and right hand limit at x equal to 0 are same now we'll find whether f dash x is differentiable or not so we find the left hand limit which is equal to minus 3h and the right hand limit which is equal to 3h again both left hand limit and right hand limit are equal to 0 therefore f double dash exists so differentiating f dash x with respect to x and applying product rule as we have two terms absolute x and x and then applying derivative of x as 1 and derivative of absolute x as x by absolute x we get 3 absolute x plus x multiplied by x by absolute x now we can simplify this to get 6 absolute x doing interval wise differentiation also we will get 6 x and minus 6 x which is same as 6 absolute x